Hi, I'm Alison Goldfrapp from Goldfrapp. I always tried to achieve a kind of strong atmosphere with each album. You know, I wanted to make something that was uncomplicated in a way, that was sort of the opposite of, of Seventh Tree, which was much more introverted. And so we really wanted to come back with something that had a, this kind of celebratory and joyous feel to it. So lots of very big, powerful melodies, big fat synth lines, very melodic synth lines. I think they have a sort of a, a simplicity to them and, and even an, a, a sort of naivety to them at times, which I, I really like. Fashion. It's that word fashion always slightly scares me because I, I kind of, what is fashion? I'm not, um, it should be fun, I guess. I kind of dabble in between sort of really, really dressing up and um, wearing things that are just very casual like I've got on now. I do love a jumpsuit. I've got a lot of jumpsuits. They're just so easy. You don't have to think. Just throw them on and you're done. <laughs> Actually, I went out to a cafe this morning and there's a couple of guys who recognised me. <laughs> I was thinking, oh no, I'm sitting there with no makeup on. I have this leopard skin bandana on. I kind of look ridiculous. <laughs> it's not the look I wanted that, at that moment. It's, it's very flattering to be told that, you know, maybe I had a part in maybe setting some kind of ground in the, this idea of what electro pop is. When we came out with the album Black Cherry. The word electropop was just something that no one really said, you know, people didn't know where to put us in. Was it dance music? Well, it's not really dance music. Is it pop music? It's not really pop music. All these things, but they've got synthesizers. And even synthesizers at that point were sort of quite unfashionable. It was kind of, you know, so there was, I think there was quite a lot of snobbery around and also like, well, what are you, you know, and what, what are you dressed in? Whereas now, electropop is a phrase that's used to um, call anything that's got a synth in it, basically, which is wonderful. Um, so it's opened up. The way the music happens and the, the visual side of things happens, it really evolves over a period of time when we're in the studio and we're writing sometimes images and, and a kind of atmosphere will inspire a song. And then also the lyrics will sort of start telling a, a story as well. So the sort of music has a narrative and the lyrics have a narrative and, and so the, these images and ideas start developing. But for me, it's not until really we start playing live that it, it, it all sort of comes together. I think that's when it all sort of suddenly makes sense. It's not just this bunch of things on a, on a record. It suddenly has this whole other life of its own. I've never talked about my private life and I suppose that this year when um, a magazine in England put a photograph of um, myself and my girlfriend, it was a bit of a shock and um, you know I've always been in a magazine because I've got an album coming out or you know I'm talking about music so it was the first time that's ever happened to me that kind of attention. Thank God it was a really good photo, that was my main issue. <laughs> that just shows how shallow I am. And that was a good photo, so that was okay. Um, but the article itself was quite quite odd. The context of it was uh, uh, it was a bit weird. And I do get asked a lot about it now, and um, I don't really know what to say. It's all good. <laughs> I'm very happy. Pop me, me, Alison. Nickname. I, d I don't have a nickname. Hometown. Alton, and it's in Hampshire, which is in southern England, and it's pretty horrible. Sign. Taurus. Turn on. Arms. I like arms, actually. Turn on. Arrogance. Vices. A good red wine. Hobbies. I've got an obsession with looking at houses that I can never afford. Dream game. <laughs> A very, very fine meal with a fine bottle of wine, uh, looking over some kind of beautiful vista. Make out song. Oh, what do you mean <laughs> whilst listening to music? Because that's bad. Ice cream. A fine strawberry ice cream. Hot me.